Hello everyone, my name is Hitesh and I welcome you all to TradeBrain's YouTube channel. Now through this video we will be understanding what are the timing of trading in India. That is the stock market timing in India or the commodities market timing in India. How do you place an order? What is the time you cannot trade? What is the time you can trade in the market? We will be trying to explain this in every facet through this video. So let us jump right into our discussion. So the, for the stock market timing in India, the real time trading happens in India bet between 9.15 am to 3.30 pm. So that is the time when the real trading happens that is buying and selling on the real time market happens in between those 6 hours 15 minutes. That is when all the buying and selling happens in the market. Now pre-opening timing. So what does the pre-open timing means? This is that time where which you can place the order in the market and even the price discovery happens at that time. So that is the 15 minute slot which at which the price discovery happens for the market as in what price should the product be opened at. Suppose that if something is closed at certain price yesterday. So it's not necessarily it will open at the same price the next day. The buying and selling scenario might change, the news might happen or some event might happen over, happened overnight. So that will impact the prices directly in the market on the next day. So the, depending on the bids and offers in the market, the pre-opening market helps us in determining at what price the share price of certain stock will open up. Again, the pre-opening time timing is divided into three different parts. So between 9 a.m. to 9.08 a.m., that is the pre-opening transactions can be placed. That is transaction to buy or sell of a certain shares or certain stock can be placed at that time. Supposedly, if I want to buy the shares of Reliance Industries, so I can choose the price at which I want to buy and I can place my bid at that price in the market in between 9 a.m. to 9.08 a.m. And between 9.08 a.m. to 9.12 a.m., the stock market timing is responsible for price determination of a security. After the initial bids or offers have been placed in the market, it is between those four minutes the matching of orders happen. We get to understand as to at what price will the particular shares be opened. Supposedly someone has placed certain order to buy say shares of XYZ company and someone has placed certain orders to sell the shares of XYZ company. So the price discovery happens in those four four minutes and we get to understand what will be the opening price of certain shares or stocks. And between 9.12 am to 9.15 am, this is the transition period between pre-opening and normal Indian market timing. Basically all the pre-opening activity happens between till 9.12 am and after that between this 3 pm there is no trading, trading activity can take place, no buying, selling, no orders can be pulled or placed in the market. This is the moment time of freeze and which time the market settles down and at 9.15 am is when the real trading activity starts in the market. Now what is the closing session? So the market closes at 3.30 pm but it doesn't mean all the activities have stopped. After that also half an hour we have closing session and which two important factors are taken into account. In between 3.30 pm to 3.40 pm the closing price of each and every security is calculated using a weighted average price. And between 3.40 pm to 4 pm you can place order for next day that is the aftermarket orders can be placed and those become active once the market starts trading again the next day. So between those 20 minutes time period you can do those kind of trades in the market. Similarly for the MCX that, that, that is the exchange where the commodities are traded. So for a non-agri commodity like a crude oil the opening of the market is at 9 am Indian time and the closing of the market is at 11.30 pm Indian standard time. And for agricultural based commodities, the opening is again at, again at 9 a.m. and the closing at 5 p.m. So the MCX timing is divided again between the agri commodities and non-agri commodities. So I hope this video gave you a decent information on the stock market timing in India. If you have any more doubts, please put your questions in the comment section. I'll be more than glad to answer it. I thank you for your patient hearing. I'll see you in the future videos of financial education. Thank you so much.